Hey everyone, this is Penny, Penny and Creations. How are you today? I hope you are having a beautiful day. All right, everyone, this is going to be a Joanne, some yarn, crafts, mixture of fabric haul. So before I show you what I ordered from Joann's, um, they had really had some good good sales and the sales is going on now. I did do a video of the sales for this month. You can find the video a um, couple of days down. And have anyone, if, if you order from Joann, have you noticed an improvement in their shipping? Because I am getting stuff um, very quick. Um, I'm, I really never had a problem with them before, but um, it seems like they're, they're really um, getting my stuff to me quick. Very quick. So I did notice that. And I noticed that some of, some of the participants in the giveaways, you are not subscribed to the channel. Although you are putting the keywords in, if I if the computer picks you and I check, and if you're not a subscriber, I'm going to have to pick another person. How do you tell if you are a subscriber? If you look at the top of my page, you will see subscribe. And if the word is in red, you have not subscribed to the channel. If it's gray, you are subscribed. So just look for the color. You don't have to click on anything because sometimes we click and we unsubscribe. So if it's highlighted in red, you are not subscribed to the channel. And if it's gray, you okay. <laughs> Pretty rhyming there. Rhyming there. <laughs> okay, you guys, let's go down. <clears throat> Juanita, which I keep calling Janita, and she didn't even correct me. Family member corrected me. Um, she won one of the giveaways a couple of weeks ago, and she was so kind to send me a couple of items and this cross. Calvin thought I made this cross because I had made a couple of crosses, and I said, what is nice? He said, those three items, no, four items, and I said, I only made three. So I said that big cross is from Janita at the time, but it's Juanita. So quite beautiful. I had to hang it up and I had to take it down. So, and my favorite color, brown. And so far on the old gold giveaway, which is the first giveaway, the Tandy, which is the brown, is, is leading in colors. I think I converted to a lot of you guys to brown. Stay away from my brown. Sorry, <laughs> I'm only kidding. And loom knitting. A book for loom knitting. See if I can get this. I don't think I'm going to be able to. It's going to blur out. Let's see if I can get this ISBN number in there. Mm -mm, not going to work. Nope, it's not going to work. Mm-hmm. So it's a really nice book. Mm-hmm. Really nice. And she's also as long as as well as many of you are loom knit. They had this um loom book at AC Moore in the front and they were clearancing out books. And it was the best book I saw. Do you know I did not I did not get that book and I still regret that to this day. So, pretty happy about this. And this is the Yarn Garden 30 Knits Using Plant-Based Fibers. That's pretty interesting. Mm -hmm. So, again, thank you, Juanita. I got to get that Janita out of my mind. I can't help it. It's just stuck there. <clears throat> okay. I ordered those big 
containers, but they're in a they're in a box and they tape together. I didn't know they was taped together. So on the next go round, I'll show them. They have some good sales, and on top of that, the coupons, twenty and twenty five percent off the order was really good. You know, really good. So I'm working on a project with the cotton cotton yarn. So this is the Lily Sugar and Cream. And peaches and cream is absolutely the same yarn, made by the same company. Just they just when they when they took over the other company, they just kept the name. Mm -hmm. This is a medium four. This is a little thicker and I would say drier, which is rough on your hands. And this is soft echo. Mm -hmm. I'm not making a project with this, but I think I'm extremely low on this. I may have one. I usually, when I make my own washcloth or dishcloth, this is what I choose for the house. And I picked up white. I'm extremely low on this one. I think this was eight and some change to nine and some change after they put it on sale and then I use the discount of course free shipping the gray I definitely need it for the project is this gray overcast apologize overcast now that I'm remembering to do this it's 14 ounces 400 grams 674 yards mm -hmm. and a medium for knit needle 4.5 which is the US 7 crochet hook which is a US H8 mm -hmm. and if you compare this with the knit pick cotton and the price I think nitpicks is um, cheaper. If you go from yard to yard, I think they are cheaper. But you have to remember, nitpicks is a medium. It's a four. This is a medium. Mm -hmm. Still my favorite for what I use it for. Mm -hmm. And this is black. And I definitely needed this for projects I'm working on. Mm -hmm. it's, it, it's been a while since I saw sugar and cream at a decent price. Normally it's $10, but for me to get it under $10, anywhere from $8, $8.50 to $9.50, that, that was an excellent deal. If I had money, I would have probably ordered more. But sales comes out at the end of the month, so I have to save my money for upcoming sales. Now, yesterday, when I talked about Karen Simply Soft and how it un unraveled on me, and a couple of nice ladies also shared their experience. And through my embroidery, what we learned that when we cut around the embroidery object, they say use fray ch check. So you keep the thread from fraying. So when I experience the Simply Soft unraveling on me, which I never experienced before. I said I would try fray check, track, fray check, or fabric type by Beacon. So this is Beacon. This is fabric tack, and this is permanent adhesive. So where I have, if I can find them, where I have those. Um, joints at and I make a knot some people don't like my knots and some of the professionals say don't make a knot but I do I will add this 
if I'm not successful, I'm going to have to just give it away to a friend. I, I'm not going to sell that. I just, I just, I'm not, I won't feel comfortable selling that. If it's in my gut, I'll feel like I don't have all of the holes, the not secure, then I'm going to have to give it away to, a, to one of my friends. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so try this fabric tack. Of course, you can use a coupon. And it's in the Notion section at Joann's. Notion section is sewing machine. I mean, sewing area. I'm not talking down to you. Um, just two years ago, I found out what the no Notion area was because I asked. It was on a coupon. It was on my coupon, 50% off Notion. And I asked one of the ladies at joann's and she said this is the notion area and i looked up and i saw the sign so that's what that means and and this stops the fraying on fabric mm -hmm. i definitely know with both of these you only need a little bit okay now i re you know want to go for it but still with the simply soft i use the simply soft before I think I did it on a scarf, so I think I only had two ends to sew in, so that could have been why I didn't unravel, why I didn't experience what I experienced with that blanket. So, when I get another chance, I am going to do another blanket and pay more attention on the 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 how the yarn reacts, and I'll let you know. I have. A ton of Simply Soft. And I'll let you see that um, in another video. So, moving on to the fabric. Joanne also had the Fat Quarters on sale, half price, to $1.50. And I picked up um, a lot of the Fat Quarters because I used this in my embroidery. And also, I need to make solid color masks because when the shutdown happened, the solid colors was difficult to find. And um, Calvin was kind of left out, but we made it work. So I was lucky enough to get some, some solid colors. Again, I use this in my embroidery and... I need to make some new masks. Look like we'll be in this stuff um, for another three years. Two, four, six in this pack. Mm -hmm. And the next day, uh, the, after I ordered this, the next day, the fat quarters went down to 10 for $10. And I was sick. Because I, uh, and then on top of you can use the 25% off coupon now, and it brought it down to roughly 75 cents. But when I did my calculation on a dollar 49 versus with the dollar, I lost in, in saving seven dollars. Wasn't that bad. And on top of it, they did not have, they did not have as many colors, part of my head, if you see in my head, they did not have as many colors as they had the, the, with the 149. So it worked out even better. That was a pop-up sale. I did not know about that. And this box. Oh, wow. This is all fabric here. See? This is all of the fabric I picked up in the solid colors. Lona, Lona, Lona. Did you get any fabric? <laughs> Did anyone else get any fabric? It's a... It's a it's a video on YouTube. I did not save it. But the lady shows you how to make a bag out of the fat quarters. 
is very interesting. She shows you, if you Google that on YouTube, how to make a bed out of fat quarters, you will see it. So, some of these colors, quite beautiful. Mm -hmm. I definitely needed uh, Christmas colors in here as well. I don't remember how many I ordered. I just ordered them. Mm -hmm. Again, a dollar forty-nine a piece, and twenty-five percent off. I don't know if I ever told you the story about the fat quarters. How I learned about them. It was this young lady. She was over there by the fat quarters, and I just was looking at them because they were all so pretty. But I didn't know what they was and what to do with them. I just can see there fabric cuts up little pieces of fabric but what do you do with them and I she had a she had a handful of them not a handful but she had some and I asked her when she was in, in high school and I asked I said what do you do with these things and she said she make hair bows for her friends so I was like oh that's pretty cool so I grabbed a couple of them and I never did anything with them. So when we, the, when we were forced to stay in the house, I remember that I had those fat quarters. Mm -hmm. Really pretty colors. And again, another stack of black. Mm -hmm. That's it, everyone. I still have some I still have some other items for Joann's to show you. So hopefully I can get to that. Get to making that video soon. All right. So thanks everyone. Appreciate you giving this video a thumbs up. I do try very, very hard. And I hope you enjoy your day. And thanks for your support. Bye.